Okay, so what we're going to focus on now is cloning or getting rid of things that you don't want in your photo. Sometimes there's just going to be those things that you don't want or things that you want to fix in your photograph. So in this one we can immediately see there's this little leaf that's sitting here which I really don't like and I want it out. So there's a couple of ways of doing that. There's a spot healing brush. Make sure your radius is nice and big enough. You paint over that and ensuring that content aware is ticked up here once you paint it over it, the computer will automatically, the program should we say, will automatically replace that for you. So you can go around and remove whatever you want. Just put more grass in there and let's take that out there. Very simple, very easy. Another thing we can use is your clone stamp tool. So your clone stamp tool, you can increase or decrease the brush radius your opacity up here which I usually use 100 initially and let's see that this dark spot I don't want there anymore so I'm going to select by press holding alt down and you'll see you'll get that crosshairs there and you select I want it from that area and now you go and you paint in here just to remove that and let's get some more from there and a good idea is to always keep on changing your source selection so that it blends in especially with a background like this blends in and doesn't have this repetitiveness and if you want to see repetitiveness and what it looks like there we go whoops here that is repetitiveness you get this repetitiveness here as you can see has obviously been retouched and badly so you'll take from different areas and put them in there now if you want to blend in like you see there's a slight bit of repetitiveness there you can change your opacity down to between, like I use 40%, and then just slightly change in there, and you'll get rid of that repetitiveness just softly. And that is another way of removing something that you don't want in there. Another simple way is let's look at this branch. So if you go over to your spot healing tool and you hold it down, you'll see that you'll get a patch healing tool which is very nice because all you do is draw around that subject that you don't want there click in it and hold and drag and with content to wear it will actually replace that branch for you so you can see now when you click before and after we have made some successful cloning and healing to this image to just remove all the unwanted distractions from it very easy, very helpful, always important to work on a separate layer and not the original layer so that you are working non-destructively.